Like everyone else on the ground at Pearl Harbor, the two pilots who would soon shoot down the first Japanese planes of the war were caught completely by surprise. In fact, as they sped down the road to the nearest airfield 10 miles away, dodging the strafing Japanese planes that pursued them from above, one of the men was still wearing his tuxedo pants from the previous night's party. But despite the fancy clothes, these young men were ready for war. Within moments of hopping into their partially armed P-40Bs and taking to the sky, each pilot shot down a Nakajima B-5N2 Kate bomber. They then landed, but only long enough to rearm, refuel, and take off again. During the dogfights, one of the pilots was shot when a bullet pierced his canopy, going straight through his arm and sending shrapnel into his leg. The two men shot down six Japanese planes between them, earning them both the Distinguished Service Cross. They were among the only five Air Force pilots who managed to confront the Japanese that day.